What's up guys, so today Telltale released some pictures for Tales from the Wildlands. I'm going to give you my opinions and I can show some things that I actually caught in these pictures. So, first thing you know in the picture is that you see the whole button design has been changed. I like this, and you see that the font of the you know text too, as well as the whole timer. So, I'm glad they're actually giving Tales from the Wildlands its own unique feel, because, you know, I think The Walking Dead and The Wolf Among Us actually share button design and font. So, Having Tales from Wonderland have a unique feel to it, using button design and the text, is kind of like something new. So, it is pretty good. So, I want to talk about this a little bit. So, you see the, you know, three choices of responses. You see, what happened to your arm? Who are you people? No one commandeers my van. So, this does imply that Fiona does not know him yet, which is pretty interesting to see how they actually develop a relationship and become partners or whatever they are. So, moving on to the next picture. We have Reese controlling this Hyperion robot to choke out this Psycho. Now, we've seen this back at their panel they had in some event, so I'm not going to go all into that. So, Reese has the power to control Hyperion or machinery at that, so that's an interesting power to see how he actually uses that. So, moving on to the next picture, we have the craziness that's in Borderlands. Now, obviously this is like a key feature because, you know, everyone in this world is just mad. They're just, you know all psycho and everything so nice to see that actually incorporating this cause it can't be borderlands without all the madness inside of it so moving on the next picture we have Zero one of the protagonists in borderlands 2 now you see the graphics I want to point that out a lot cause you need to see the gore in the graphics now obviously this isn't on the telltale engine but you know cause Gearbox did give them assets which is basically you know their whole tool set, like, you know, graphics and everything, so, you can see where it actually favors, um, the Borderlands, so, you see that the graphics look pretty nice now, that, that severed arm, it looks pretty, pretty nice, I'm really loving the graphic style, it's looking pretty good, you can actually notice that, you know, on the characters, you see, I mean, obviously, Telltale, not Telltale, but The Walking Dead and Borderlands do share a graphic style because they are shell shaded so, it can actually benefit the graphics while not adding not removing that telltale feel from it, so it's pretty nice to see that they're actually getting a company that actually works with shell shading and bringing that into this game, so it's pretty nice, I'm really loving this picture because you see the gore looking pretty awesome and I'm wondering what kind of role Zero will play in the story, so moving on to the next picture we have Fiona, not much info on this but you can actually tell that they're keeping the whole you know, let me, let go of me now, which is a mean one. Let's discuss this, like, same people, which is kind of like the whole civil way to go about it. And then you have, it's not what you think, which is kind of like the whole innocent role. So, maybe she got in trouble with some people. Maybe there's some crazy guy coming up to her. We don't know yet. So, that's all we got from these screenshots. Pretty nice ones. Gotta say, actually, glad they actually gave us something of this game. Hoping to get more. Probably even a trailer or something, because... This game looking pretty good. I can't wait for it, and I'm pretty sure it's going to be a good game. So, thank you all for watching. Make sure to thumbs up for these pictures. They were awesome, and I'm really loving them. And I will catch you guys later. I'm out. I just noticed this right now, but if you look at this picture and this picture, both of the button designs look different. And, you know, you see the text is blue here, and, it, and this one is red. Now, I'm wondering, would that design be Reese's dialogue um whole set and would the other one be Fiona's so that would be pretty interesting to actually have you know two characters with their own design of button layout so it wouldn't be so confusing so that is all now I'm out